Okay, I just would like to demonstrate how to um, scan yourself. So I'm using the Atseco FC, FC6002 MK2 RF tracer. I'm going to turn it on. It has a signal and I'm going to turn it down just below. It's seeing a signal. Let me just tweak it. Okay, it just has to be on the threshold. Hang on, that shows background. Turn it below background, okay. And now, let it just um, pick up on signals. Um, because they have just turned on something. It's like I'm implanted here and here. Um, that's why I'm just wearing just this so you can see that there's absolutely nothing. Hang on, I need to turn up the sensitivity, I hope you can see. Okay, right. So, now I just need to scan that. Can you see the signal? So I'm just going to scan the environment. Um, and there's no signal here. However, if I come towards myself, suddenly it will start picking up signals there. Can you see? There. So um, you need to hold this away because this is a bug finder, so it starts picking up on this. There, the bug's there. Yeah, there's nothing here, but if I come close, it's there, okay? That is a Geiger counter, it's the Geiger alarm. So now I'm going to scan elsewhere. I just found a chip somewhere here, oh there. Can you see it? Um, it needs to hone in because this one, there. Can you see? It's there. And you need to rotate the antenna so it aligns with the chip. The, there, there's the. Can you hear? So there's also one here. There. Mm -hmm. Let me uh, maybe I can stand on this. Um, So I'm taking it away, okay. Oops, it's now picking up on the signal, hang on. So pointing it away shows nothing, no beeping. And now coming back, there. Can you see? And then aligning, it's The chip is there, so scanning further down, this is the chip here. Did you hear? There. That's the chip here. Okay. Hang on, so it kind of locks onto the frequency, so you have to um, reset it. You know, if you get a really strong signal, you have to reset it or make it go away, otherwise it will just pick up the emissions everywhere. So I'm just going to turn it down. Just turn it down so that there's nothing. So now it starts honing in again. And again, I can come down and I can show you the chip somewhere up here. That's a really strong one. That one usually locks on quite quickly. There, yeah, there, because I can feel it. There, there, you can see it. It starts picking up the bug, and these are very, very fine little implants there. So, if I just hold it here, yeah. so you really found the chip when you can make it beep, when it locks on to the signal and actually finds it. There's a really big one there. 
can you tell? That's at the back of my head. It immediately made, it immediately started beeping. So there's nothing here. Nothing here. Okay, so in... Hang on. There. Okay, that, that, then you can see there's nothing behind. Okay, right? There's nothing behind. Um, and now you can scan on for other chips here on the side. There. In the ears. Yeah. That's the chip that's non stop communicating. There's nothing here, right? I mean, this is still the ear chip. That beeps immediately. Here it doesn't. There. And I, I got to this like a demonstration effect there. Can you see? That's where the chip is. Okay, that's where the chip is. Here at the top of my head, actually on this side, there's a lot of activity. It hurts. So, let's find the chips. There. Yeah? There. There you go. See, so sometimes the chips stop emitting there. That is kind of like here. Okay? And then this, I've got one in the neck. There. That's done. I, I'm holding it down there. Okay, so somewhere there I've got a chip as well. There. Can you see? You can just see it's flickered. Where is it? Ah! There's one there. It kind of gets stronger when you're spot on in your lines. Okay. There. Sorry, this is just like so silly, but... So I found these in a previous video. And they are kind of like on the spine, on the back, here on the sides, in the ears. Here in the ears, that one's... Sometimes they're not emitting. So Melanie has a really strong one in one of her ears and another one that's less strong. So let me demonstrate the strongness here. Yeah? That's the chip that they spoke into. There's an actual microphone in there. Wow, huh? Okay. Okay. Here. Nothing. Nothing. Okay. Can you see? There's absolutely nothing. Right, I'll try to reproduce the effect. Um, can you? I can't actually see what you can see, but I'll try to find the chip blind. Um, so it helps when you can see when the um, red line, red light goes very intense. I can't actually see anything, but I was trying to show you. Um, I can see the in, um, the video stalling, but I can see that it's flickering when it gets close to my ear, and then I can make it um, beep. So I've got a really strong one in here, but in there, not so strong. Okay, so now let's search on. Um, so I'm trying to, uh, there, can you see, there's one here, there, okay, so that's pretty strong because it hurts as well, and with women they're trying to give them breast cancer, so, um, there's one there, you know, this is really strong, so you have to kind of wave it around and make it lose the um, signal because it just locks on there. <sighs> okay, yeah, finished, finished. So nothing, 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 nothing. There, okay. Go away, go away, go away. Measure something, but there's nothing. Nothing, nothing, nothing. It's coming closer. 
there and there it really hurts as well okay so that's where it is that's where the chip is and then there's one here on the side okay now the video keeps stalling I might have to um and, oops. and I'll show you how I switched off the um uh, the fuse box there. I need to align. Maybe this one down here is easier to find. Oops. Sorry, I'm just going to stand up. Oh. Um, so if you can see I've got no emitters, nothing under there. I'm just trying to search. Yeah. Can you see the flickering? There. Stops. The one here. Make it stop. So it's still picking up the signal because these are pretty, pretty strong things. And I've just felt that they turned these on. So this thing goes nuts. Okay, go away, go away, signal. So you might have to reset it to absolutely not. So you can see it stopped beeping, but it can still detect the signal. Okay, so now this one's going crazy because, and I'll explain why. So now this is going crazy. It has increased its sensitivity level. And now what you can do is it now goes up to two. It's really honing in. It went up to two because it's honing in on the frequency range where the bugs are. And then you can find the position of the bugs by going to the point where there are two. But it started beeping straight away because the sensitivity, there is the bug or the microphone. And the reason why it keeps beeping is because um, this, the range is one megahertz to six gigahertz. That's a huge range. And in the beginning, it doesn't know what sort of bugs you might have in your home. So it's scanning the entire really wide range. Okay. When it finds a signal, it hones in. Okay. When it hones in, it starts beeping. Okay, and then you can find the bug by looking at the point where there are two bars, which is somewhere. Ah. Hang on, you saw it there, somewhere there. I have to align there. Can you see? That's where it is. Okay, so you can you can also operate it in this mode where there's one bar, and then you try to hone in, and then maybe. Yeah, there you can see two bars. Do you see? Because it's there's the two. If I move away, there's one. There's two. There's only one. And there. Get the alignment right. Hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on. So it's clearer when there's only when you don't have the noise, but I can, I can find these bugs. There. Did you see it flickered up to two when you are scanning at the right point? But there are two, so you have to get the alignment right, and you have to get, the chip has to be emitting, and you have to get the antenna that, ah, <laughs> that's just me touching, or is it me aligning? I think it's me aligning there. There's the chip. Can you see? That's two, but I'm just moving away and the chip is emitting sometimes and sometimes not. So the chip is there. Okay. Can you see? The chip is there. Okay, so they put one on the side of the breasts. I am not going to strip down to my bra to prove to you that I don't have anything under. I'm just going to go back to my head. And you can see the second chip. It's going up to two bars now there. Where the chip is there the chip is there okay and then it goes down it should go down there's the other chip it's flickering hang on it's it's sometimes you have to reset by just you know otherwise it keeps honing in on the sensitivity so make sure there's only one bar reliably only one bar and then you can already see it's picking them up there's two. Make it go away. Oh, 
otherwise it relocks to two bars and then you have to look for three and so on you know what I mean um, so this thing is now really finely honed in so you have to turn it away from yourself okay point it away from yourself you can see there's only one oops as I'm turning it towards me it starts flickering but there should be only one away from me yes and now coming towards me it's picking up these bugs going up to two bars yes and then here at the back you could see it dips there's nothing there and then here at the back it picks up already the second one but oh did it go up to three did I see that go up to three it should do because it keeps um, the algorithm keeps zoning in ever closer onto the actual frequency range um, let me just open the door 